All right, my glasses snapped in half. His fault was that. Um, yours for having ten-year-old glasses, maybe. I dropped them, but it was it was a faulty glasses issue. So I've been without my glasses for about two weeks now. Yep. And today, I'm getting an eye exam and hopefully new glasses. Hopefully. Hopefully. Eye exams are kind of tough for you. Hopefully gonna... all that. We'll talk about the uh, accessibility stuff in a bit. Going into this appointment, I was not optimistic. I got my first pair of glasses when I was in late middle school, early high school, and the process was not very easy, which probably doesn't surprise you. Similar to the difficulties I had finding a dentist, every eye doctor I went to 10 years ago, or 20 years ago, wanted me to get out of my wheelchair to access the different machines that they use to like measure my eyes or whatever they do. Um, and I didn't. I remember at this one appointment, I had to get up to this machine that I could put my eyes in and like look into and I didn't reach it in my wheelchair. So my mom uh, had to like lift me up out of my chair and like lean me forward and then hover me there until they could get the image. It was painful, probably for my mom also. Um, it was just not easy. And by the end, it felt like they hadn't done a great job of like accurately assessing my eyes. So I was worried that here in Minnesota, years later, it would be the same deal. So I have to access these devices. Okay, it did not work. I did not get <laughs> close enough to any of the devices. Yeah. Um, but that's not a, what's the word? An issue? An issue. Um, <laughs> they said that the doctor can do all the tests. Yeah, herself. Like, independently. Yeah, without they, a machine, Without I guess. a machine, yeah. So, so we're good. <laughs> we're good so far. They're being really, really accommodating and friendly. Like, they're not, yeah. they're not being awkward about it. <laughs> Okay. Let's see if there's a difference between page one, two, two. Welcome to our December HelloFresh video. Today we're making pasta primavera with lemon parm sauce, bell pepper, zucchini, and peas. It's actively blizzarding outside and then mm -hmm. nothing goes better with a blizzard than primavera so i've heard so it's been told uh-huh the holidays can be hectic but hellofresh keeps it simple with recipes and ingredients that cut out grocery shopping and limit meal time prep so you can spend more of the festive season with friends and family hellofresh offers so many recipes to choose from each week to help you break out of your recipe rut hellofresh is a can't beat value even at full price, it's pre-proportioned ingredients, then you don't waste money on excess food. What are you... What are you doing? They say a watch pot never boils, huh? Guess that doesn't apply to me. <laughs> HelloFresh cuts down on your food waste by at least 25% compared to grocery shopping. <laughs> oh, yum. Oh, I have an idea. Show them the meal with the background of the blizzard while we tell them about our offer. Go to HelloFresh.com and use toast Chromie and Drums 14 for up to 14 free meals and 3 free gifts. Again, go to HelloFresh.com and use toast Chromie and Drums 14 for up to 14 free meals and 3 free gifts. Thank you. Alright, Shane's glasses are ready to be picked up and a blizzard is beginning here. So we were sort of torn between, do we wait like multiple days probably to go get the glasses? Or do we come, do we go now at the beginning of the blizzard? So we decided, decided to go, obviously. We're in the car. Because it's all like small 
roads to get to the mall. Yeah. So we, we feel like we can just go one mile an hour the whole way. And we'll just get we'll, there. We'll be fine. Even if we crash, we'll be going one mile an hour. So we'll be fine. Even if we have to live at the mall <laughs> we'll for a few days. It's like at least my, you'll have your my dream. I know. Sleep right there. I read a story, an article about Ikea. people who got stranded in Ikea and I they had to that. spend the night. I was like, oh my God, that has been my dream since I was a teenager. All right, hurry, the snow's piling up. Okay. We made it. We're here. It wasn't bad at all. <laughs> How did they look? Wow. You like them? I'm obsessed with them. I you think like, they look great. They look like an author. You look like a writer, author. An intellectual. Intellectual YouTuber. <laughs> Here they are. Here they are. Ooh, ooh, wait, let me just do my modeling poses. This one's called Angry Professor. Why didn't you turn in your homework on time? Oh my god. This one's called Fond father. Are you looking at your child? Oh, yeah, my child <laughs> hit his first home run. <laughs> so, really, your glasses, the look you're going for is like mature adult. You're mature, a professor, father. Intelligent adult. Oh, and intelligent also. Cool. I mean, look at me. Yeah. Look at me. Uh huh. Do all look intelligent? <laughs> hey, ready? Can you remove them, please? First, we have this. Hmm. Stellar. Mm hmm. Now. See? And who is that? You just you without glasses. That's me before glasses. She's dull. Not a thought in the world. Wow. That's crazy how just a pair of glasses can huh. totally Pierce, change who you are. Pierce Brosnan. All right. <sighs> Meets Michelangelo. I think they look great. They do. Do they? Wait, can you put your left side on? Your hair got fuzzled up. Something about. My long face, because let's, let's not beat around the bush. Mm -hmm. I have a very long, angular face, sure. hawk white. <laughs> and uh, the roundness of the glasses somehow. Yeah, it balances it out. Works well. Yep. This is actually the pair that the employee uh, gave Shane to try on first. He was like, I think you'd like these. And Shane tried them on and loved them. And I was like, you should try on a couple others. So he tried on the rest. and had fallen in love with the first, so. And they're super lightweight. Look. Yep. They don't fall down. Not falling down. Casey can't tell what I'm doing. Ow, hurting my neck. Yeah, be careful. But they're great. They are great. And I can see better than ever before. The world is my oyster. I wonder what I will compose. What? I don't know. Now that I'm a scholar. Oh.